so I don't even remember what time I woke up today, but it was late. And, uh, yeah, thing about being sober, or I don't know if it's sober or sane or whatever, um, the thing about my life is that every day is different. And I find that, um, the variety is vexing. So... assume is the preferred fingering, at least, no I won't. <laughs> I don't know, what I was, if you saw what my fingers were trying to do there, it would have been an easy way to get from E to E minor to E7 to E minor major 7 to E minor ADD 9, whatever this is. six and then let's do these uh, cross my fingers I'm, <laughs> these days I'm like whenever I have an opportunity to cross my fingers during a side-by-side uh, -side chord I'll just call it that a side-by-side -side chord uh, I do. Just punishment for my hands. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So basically the point is I can't do that, and then we have this cross. So let's, for the sake of, um, yesterday I started practicing, or actually a few days ago I started practicing going over the same thing multiple times instead of just getting through it once.
Okay, what a pretty. No. So, is this it? Yes. six. said there's something called voicing. So apparently if I get this one, this one down, um, this hand yoga requiring one down, it will have a better voice than the other E6. chart I like. I'm gonna have to num start numbering the order in which I did the chords. So anyways, um, D6. because I just mastered it.
pressing down on five or six enough. My fingers actually do hurt quite a bit, so it's possible I'm not pressing down, and it's possible there's not much I can do about that. Oh, of course, G minor. And this is, okay, so three, five, Oh, oh, this is even trickier than I thought. Tricky, tricky. Okay. So, okay, yeah, I can't do that. I'm going to leave it on the chart, but I, I can't do that. No, I can't do either of those. I'm talking about um, G major that starts at the fifth fret and G minor that starts at the 5th fret. Yeah, I, I, I don't know, when I, when I was looking at it, I thought, yeah, I thought it was similar to B major 7. Um, I'll just do B major 7 now so you can see what I'm talking about. starts at the fifth, I have to see how with this there was the top string and then immediately one down there was a string and then one down from that there was a string. With the fifth, where are we, three, five, so with the fifth you've got your, your top fret, uh, top fret string, then you just skip one of these, unless I wrote it down wrong, and then you do one of these and one of these. And same problem I have with E6, my hand just doesn't stretch like that. At least not yet. Anyways, so, uh, we didn't do C, I think. because I forget about all the C's there. Do C7, and this is, see, another example. So you start with this fret, then you go to this fret, then you go to this fret. And if it were the G major that starts at the fifth, I would be going like this, and then these two fingers would have to get down there. And that is like super impossible. My friends keep sending me impossible things and I get mad at them. I'm like, what the hell? Do you honestly expect me to know how to do this? But they're like, dude, you didn't even think you could do any of this. So, I don't know. I took an anxiety pill. I might sound a little drunk. <laughs> And let's pause to play with our song. So that's just 
is my song. And I have a different song that I'm getting better at. I, I was half asleep and someone said, when you're asleep you don't learn. But anyways, let's just get through the bees, because bees need to be corded. And, or what do you call it? Barred, corded. Okay, bees need to be barred, and I need to bar some things. considering the first string is always messed up. I think we already did B7. For some reason B7 seems like something I already did. At any rate, there it is again. And we definitely did B major 7. repeat F twice, but I'm not in the mood, but work hard pays off, pay off if you work hard, so you are in the mood, okay.
Okay. And there we go. And did we do the bees twice? Let's do the bees twice. And if it's the third time doing the bees, so be so be it. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, let's drop it. Straight ahead to dessert. Practice-wise, I mean. Thank you. 
probably just have to do that over and over and again, but I want to get it, I don't want to just fumble with it, I want to, I want the notes to be s s solid. And that takes us to E7 slash D and EB, which are, okay, so if that's there, then that's there. Okay, this is E7 slash D. This is E slash B. Okay, so that's part of the song, but we don't know where that goes. And now we do the pluck. don't have to be a speed demon, but obviously that is the intention of what that is doing, so whatever. That is that. Um, so that's everything. And can I just see what my time is? Oh yeah, right. perfectly reasonable. Half an hour, that's perfectly reasonable. Thank you.